Yo, what is up YouTube, it's Darkfang here, back with another video, and today I'll be talking about the Tenno and what new abilities I think they should have. Before we start the video, I want to say two things. One, if you haven't played the War Within quest, then I suggest not watching this since this has spoilers and the gameplay in the background is the last boss on War Within. So yeah, also if you haven't played War Within, you should, because it's like the best quest ever. So yeah, and two, this is not something that the have like said they would add or even hinted towards it. It's just something I thought would be cool. So yeah, let's get into it. Fourth time I'm doing this audio, <laughs> let's just do this. So, in Deathstream 98, we were introduced to more uh, Planes of Eidolon info, the glass frame, and other things. One of the things that was quite cool that they were talking about for some time is a new combat Tenno mode, or warrior mode, or whatever, where you can give your Tenno armor, you can give your Tenno armor pretty much, that looks like Teshans. Uh, yeah, this is not what I'll be talking about. I'm thinking more to the future, and it's more like an idea for DE, even though they'll never watch this video or anything. Uh, but yeah, so if you remember the War Was Inquest, the most annoying part for all of us was the part where we had to get from A to B without getting eaten by those stupid worm things. I don't have any f video footage, but if you don't remember what I'm talking about, here's a picture right here. Yeah, so if you um can't remember, so yeah. If you remember to the end of that cave, like that cave part, you had to escape the cave by using transference to turn into a worm. I don't know about you guys, but that was like pretty good part, I'm not going to lie to the quest. I, I actually quite liked that. Even though my screen was like pretty much pitch black, I couldn't hardly really see any, I could hardly see anything. Apart from when I like stunned the enemy, I could see some like a flash. But yeah, my screen was pretty dark, but that doesn't matter. So, why didn't D bring this back, uh let us like do this again like the transference thing to control your enemies like it would um it'd be a cool addition to the game I'm not gonna lie um so yeah this could be used for amber frames but i'll get more into detail about that in a minute for now how would it work well same as it did with the worm you stun the enemy with your tenno and then get close to them and transference into them body for a limited time because if it was too long it'd be kind of op this could be used in Eidolon for some enemies to help you with your mission. I mean, in the quest, we used a worm to break free and take down the gates. So what's stopping D letting us do this again, but with other things? It'd be pretty cool. I mean, I'm surprised they didn't add it in the boss battle on War Was In and let us control the Queen's guards. That'd be pretty cool. But now, how would this work with Umbra? Well, the trailer shows Umbra in like a cave in Lua or something like that. Maybe the Umber frame is keeping the cave place from crashing down. Think about it. Have you ever watched those films where like they uh, they're like in a cave or something? People are in a cave and they have to take a take something, but if they take it, it triggers a um, a trap. And to uh, prevent the trap from happening, they usually put something on to replace it. I bet that sounded pretty confusing. So, so here's a video ex um, just explaining that. Yeah, like that, but you don't fail when you put the thing on like this idiot. Anyway, what does this have to do with Umbra, you may be asking? Well, as I said before, the Umbra frame is like the sculpture in the video, and your Warframe is a pouch full of sand. That would explain the whole sacrifice thing. You would have to put one of your <laughs> Warframes in for that frame. But that's just my thoughts, you know? I mean, it's... It's cool, you know? It would be actually quite cool. So tell me your thoughts on the subject in the comments below. Should they bring this transference thing back? Or should it just be a one-time thing and the war was in? Um, or what are your thoughts about the sacrifice trailer for Umbra? And what do you think we'll have to, like, sacrifice for the cool-looking Umbra frame? And uh, what do you think about the new warrior combat Tenno thing? The, do you think it's great? Do you think it sucks? Do you like it? Do you hate it? You know, just put them in the comments below. I, I, read pretty much every comment because 
I, I, I don't get pretty that many. So yeah, anyway, I thank you all for watching the video. Um, if you enjoyed it, leave a like. Subscribe for more videos. Um, join the Discord, links in the description. Share the video, click the bell button to get notified of my videos. And I'll see you in the next one. Wah.